Highway, Wikipedia Audio A highway is any public or private road or other public way on land. It is used for major roads, but also includes other public roads and public tracks, it is not an equivalent term to controlled access highway, or a translation for autobahn, autoroute, etc. In North American and Australian English, major roads such as controlled access highways or arterial roads are often state highways. Other roads may be designated county highways in the U.S. and Ontario. These classifications refer to the level of government that maintains the roadway. In British English, highway is primarily a legal term. Everyday use normally implies roads, while the legal use covers any route or path with a public right of access, including footpaths etc. Overview The term has led to several related derived terms, including highway system, highway code, highway patrol, and highwayman. The term highway exists in distinction to waterway. Any way over which there is a public right of passage and includes the road's verge, and any bridge over which, or tunnel through which, the road passes, and any reference to a road includes a part thereof. Major highways are often named and numbered by the governments that typically develop and maintain them. Australia's Highway 1 is the longest national highway in the world at over 14,500 kilometres or 9,000 miles and runs almost the entire way around the continent. China has the world's largest network of highways followed closely by the United States of America. Some highways, like the Pan American Highway or the European routes, span multiple countries. Some major highway routes include ferry services, such as U.S. Route 10, which crosses Lake Michigan. Traditionally highways were used by people on foot or on horses. Later they also accommodated carriages, bicycles and eventually motor cars, facilitated by advancements in road construction. In the 1920s and 1930s, many nations began investing heavily in progressively more modern highway systems to spur commerce and bolster national defense. Major modern highways that connect cities in populous developed and developing countries usually incorporate features intended to enhance the road's capacity, efficiency, and safety to various degrees. Such features include a reduction in the number of locations for user access, the use of dual carriageways with two or more lanes on each carriageway, and grade separated junctions with other roads and modes of transport. These features are typically present on highways built as motorways. The general legal definition deals with right of use not the form of construction, this is distinct from e.g. the popular use of the word in the U.S. A highway is defined in English common law by a number of similarly worded definitions such as a way over which all members of the public have the right to pass and repass without hindrance usually accompanied by at all times. Ownership of the ground is for most purposes irrelevant thus the term encompasses all such ways from the widest trunk roads in public ownership to the narrowest footpath providing unlimited pedestrian access over private land. A highway might be open to all forms of lawful land traffic or limited to specific types of traffic or combinations of types of traffic, usually a highway available to vehicles is available to foot or horse traffic, a highway available to horse traffic is available to pedestrians but exceptions can apply usually in the form of a highway only being available to vehicles or subdivided into dedicated parallel sections for different users. A highway can share ground with a private right of way for which full use is not available to the general public as often will be the case with farm roads which the owner may use for any purpose but for which the general public only has a right of use on foot or horseback.
The status of highway on most older roads has been gained by established public use while newer roads are typically dedicated as highways from the time they are adopted. In England and Wales, a public highway is also known as the Queen's Highway. The core definition of a highway is modified in various legislation for a number of purposes but only for the specific matters dealt with in each such piece of legislation. This is typically in the case of bridges, tunnels and other structures whose ownership, mode of use or availability would otherwise exclude them from the general definition of a highway. Examples in recent years are commonly toll bridges and tunnels which have the definition of highway imposed upon them to allow application of most traffic laws to those using them but without causing all of the general obligations or rights of use otherwise applicable to a highway. Terminology Scots law is similar to English law with regard to highways but with differing terminology and legislation. What is defined in England as a highway will often in Scotland be what is defined by S.151 Roads Act 1984 simply as a road, that is. The word highway is itself no longer a statutory expression in Scots law but remains in common law. In American law, the word highway is sometimes used to denote any public way used for travel, whether a road, street, and parkway, however, in practical and useful meaning, a highway is a major and significant, well-constructed road that is capable of carrying reasonably heavy to extremely heavy traffic. Highways generally have a route number designated by the state and federal departments of transportation. California Vehicle Code, Sections 360, 590, define a highway as only a way open for use of motor vehicles, but the California Supreme Court has held that the definition of highway in the Vehicle Code is used for special purposes of that act and that canals of the Los Angeles neighborhood of Venice, California, are highways that are entitled to be maintained with state highway funds. Smaller roads may be termed byways. Modern highway systems developed in the 20th century as the automobile gained popularity. The world's first limited access road was constructed on Long Island, New York in the United States known as the Long Island Motor Parkway or the Vanderbilt Motor Parkway. It was completed in 1911. Construction of the Bon Cologne Autobahn began in 1929 and it was opened in 1932 by the mayor of Cologne, Conrad Adenauer. In the USA, the Federal Aid Highway Act of 1921 enacted a fund to create an extensive highway system. In 1922, the first blueprint for a national highway system was published. The Federal Aid Highway Act of 1956 allocated $25 billion for the construction of the 41,000-mile-long interstate highway system over a 20-year period. England and Wales Scotland In Great Britain, the Special Roads Act 1949 provided the legislative basis for roads for restricted classes of vehicles and non-standard or no speed limits applied. In terms of general road law this legislation overturned the usual principle that a road available to vehicular traffic was also available to horse or pedestrian traffic as is usually the only practical change when non-motorways are reclassified as special roads. The first section of motorway in the UK opened in 1958 and then in 1959 the first section of the M1 motorway. United States History Social Effects Economic Effects Environmental Effects Reducing travel times relative to city or town streets, 
modern highways with limited access and grade separation create increased opportunities for people to travel for business, trade, or pleasure and also provide trade routes for goods. Modern highways reduce commute and other travel time but additional road capacity can also release latent traffic demand. If not accurately predicted at the planning stage, this extra traffic may lead to the new road becoming congested sooner than would otherwise be anticipated by considering increases in vehicle ownership. More roads allow drivers to use their cars when otherwise alternatives may have been sought, or the journey may not have been made, which can mean that a new road brings only short-term mitigation of traffic congestion. Where highways are created through existing communities, there can be reduced community cohesion and more difficult local access. Consequently, property values have decreased in many cut-off neighborhoods, leading to decreased housing quality over time. In transport, demand can be measured in numbers of journeys made or in total distance traveled across all journeys for private transport. Supply is considered to be a measure of capacity. The price of the good is measured using the generalized cost of travel, which includes both money and time expenditure. Road Traffic Safety The effect of increases in supply are of particular interest in transport economics, as the potential environmental consequences are significant. In addition to providing benefits to their users, Transport networks impose both positive and negative externalities on non-users. The consideration of these externalities particularly the negative ones is a part of transport economics. Positive externalities of transport networks may include the ability to provide emergency services, increases in land value and agglomeration benefits. Negative externalities are wide-ranging and may include local air pollution, noise pollution, light pollution, safety hazards, community severance and congestion. The contribution of transport systems to potentially hazardous climate change is a significant negative externality which is difficult to evaluate quantitatively making it difficult to include in transport economics based research and analysis. Congestion is considered a negative externality by economists. A 2016 study finds that for the United States a 10% increase in a region's stock of highways causes a 1.7% increase in regional patenting over a five-year period. Highways are extended linear sources of pollution. Roadway noise increases with operating speed so major highways generate more noise than arterial streets. Therefore, considerable noise health effects are expected from highway systems. Noise mitigation strategies exist to reduce sound levels at nearby sensitive receptors. The idea that highway design could be influenced by acoustical engineering considerations first arose about 1973. Air quality issues, highways may contribute fewer emissions than arterials carrying the same vehicle volumes. This is because high, constant speed operation creates an emissions reduction compared to vehicular flows with stops and starts. However, Concentrations of air pollutants near highways may be higher due to increased traffic volumes. Therefore, the risk of exposure to elevated levels of air pollutants from a highway may be considerable, and further magnified when highways have traffic congestion. New highways can also cause habitat fragmentation, encourage urban sprawl, and allow human intrusion into previously untouched areas as well as increasing congestion, by increasing the number of intersections. Statistics They can also reduce the use of public transport, indirectly leading to greater pollution. 
High occupancy vehicle lanes are being added to some newer slash reconstructed highways in North America and other countries around the world to encourage carpooling and mass transit. These lanes help reduce the number of cars on the highway and thus reduces pollution and traffic congestion by promoting the use of carpooling in order to be able to use these lanes. However, they tend to require dedicated lanes on a highway which makes them difficult to construct in dense urban areas where they are the most effective. Bus Lane To address habitat fragmentation, wildlife crossings have become increasingly popular in many countries. Wildlife crossings allow animals to safely cross human-made barriers like highways. Road traffic safety describes the safety performance of roads and streets, and methods used to reduce the harm on the highway system from traffic collisions. It includes the design, construction, and regulation of the roads, the vehicles used on them and the training of drivers and other road users. South Korea Hong Kong Philippines a report published by the World Health Organization in 2004 estimated that some 1.2 m people were killed and 5.0 m injured on the roads around the world each year and was the leading cause of death among children 10-19 years of age. The report also noted that the problem was most severe in developing countries and that simple prevention measures could have the number of deaths. For reasons of clear data collection, only harm involving a road vehicle is included. A person tripping with fatal consequences or dying for some unrelated reason on a public road is not included in the relevant statistics. The United States has the world's largest network of highways, including both the interstate highway system and the U.S. highway system. At least one of these networks is present in every state and they interconnect most major cities. China's highway network is the second most extensive in the world, with a total length of about 3.573 million km. China's expressway network is the longest expressway system in the world, and it is quickly expanding stretching some 85,000 km at the end of 2011. In 2008 alone, 6,433 km expressways were added to the network. Some countries incorporate bus lanes onto highways. In South Korea, in February 1995 bus lane established between the northern terminus and Sintanjin for important holidays and on July 1, 2008 bus lane enforcement between Seoul and Ozan becomes daily between 6 a.m. and 10 p.m. On October 1 this is adjusted to 7 a.m. to 9 p.m. weekdays, 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. weekends. In Hong Kong some highways are set up with bus lanes to solve the traffic congestion. Traffic congestion was a principal problem in major roads and highways in the Philippines, especially in Metro Manila and other major cities. The government decided to set up some bus lanes in Metro Manila like in the Epifanio de los Santos Avenue. Gravelly Hill Interchange in Birmingham, England a one motorway near Athens, Greece with rest area above. The 10-lane highway A1 near Bologna, Italy. A Polish expressway in Bielskobiala. E4 motorway with rest area outside Nykoping, Sweden. Highway 401 with collector and express lanes Indiana-Mississauga, Ontario, Canada. Highway 404 with HOV lanes in Toronto, Ontario, Canada. The Pan American Highway where it serves as the main street in Mancora, Peru. A typical expressway in China. North Lantau Highway in Hong Kong. A typical Indian highway. 
32 Lane Toll Plaza at an Indian Expressway. China, Bangalore Highway. Mumbai Pun Expressway as seen from Kandala. A highway interchange in Tehran, Iran. The Metropolitan Expressway in Tokyo, Japan. A highway in Kuwait City. Karakoram Highway, Pakistan. North Luzon Expressway, the Philippines. Namhae Expressway in Jinju. South Korea Jala Interchange in the Airport Expressway in Jala, Sri Lanka Three-fourths Highway Interchange in Dubai, United Arab Emirates National Route 1A near TSN, Vietnam Gallery General By Country